Today, you will learn how to make chocolate coconut balls. Hi, this is Natasha of natashaskitchen.com and I'm sharing our favorite no-bake holiday candy. Add two cups of unsweetened desiccated coconut to a large mixing bowl. Next, add half a cup of sweetened condensed milk, followed by five tablespoons of solid coconut oil. Make sure it's not melted. Also, add one teaspoon of vanilla extract, and we're using our homemade extract. It's just two ingredients, and I will link to it in the notes. Stir that together until it's well combined and all of the coconut is moistened. Now we're gonna add half a cup of festive red and green M&Ms. And the beauty of this recipe is you can use different colored M&Ms for a different occasion, like pink and red for Valentine's Day, Fold in the M&Ms until they're well incorporated into the batter. Make sure you do not overmix or some of the color starts to transfer to the mixture. Use a small trigger release cookie scoop like this one to make this process super easy. This is one of my favorite tools and I use it for everything from cookies to meatballs and I will link to it in the notes. You should get about 26 to 28 coconut balls, each measuring about a tablespoon. Use your hands to roll those coconut balls into smooth and even circles. Now refrigerate the coconut balls for 15 minutes. When those are nearly done chilling, we're gonna start melting our chocolate. Add one cup of semi-sweet chocolate chips to a microwave safe bowl, along with one tablespoon of coconut oil. Microwave that in 15 second increments, stirring each time until the chocolate melts. This usually takes 45 to 60 seconds in the microwave to get a smooth, silky chocolate. It's been about 15 minutes and we're gonna pull our chilled coconut balls out of the refrigerator. Use a fork to turn the cold coconut balls in the melted chocolate. Let any excess chocolate drip back into the bowl, then transfer it to a silicone or parchment lined baking sheet. Repeat that process with the remaining chocolate balls until they are all coated in chocolate. Now refrigerate those until the chocolate is completely set. In a separate bowl, melt half a cup of white chocolate chips. This usually takes 30 to 45 seconds in the microwave. Transfer that to a Ziploc bag, snip off the corner, and drizzle it over your chocolate balls. Before the white chocolate sets, add a few more M&Ms to make a little holly design. Keep in mind, white chocolate sets quickly, so add the M&Ms as you go. Oh, they are done and I cannot wait to eat these. So let's do this taste test. <laughs> okay, here we go. And you can serve these at room temperature or refrigerate them. I like them at room temperature because they have like this melting consistency. So that's what we're gonna do right now. Mmm. 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 <laughs> These really just melt in your mouth. It's such an easy, no-bake, fun dessert you can make with the whole family. And I love the surprise inside. It's loaded with M&Ms. <laughs> Hope you guys love this recipe. If you did, give us a great big thumbs up below. And thanks for watching.